because I thought I would continue with my spring shopping videos I'm going to the mall and I'm taking you along with me to go to H&M because I wanted to see what's new in the store to have a look at their new collection for spring and I personally kind of like shopping in H&M in store it's not too overwhelming or crowded so it must be very fun also, I really want to see their pieces in person because with H&M for me it's either a hit or miss. Sometimes I really don't like the quality and the feel of the materials, but when they're good, they're really, really good and I have some of the best finds. And some of my wardrobe staple pieces in my wardrobe that I wear the most are from H&M. I usually like very much their staple pieces, blazers, some shirts, blouses. They also have some nice pairs of jeans so it will be very fun for me to have a look around at the store and to choose the pieces that I really like and to show you how they fit and how they look in person here shops finally reopened so i continue with my come shopping with me videos for spring i want to do more about zara mango H&M today. I'm also doing a Zara haul next week and actually when I come back from the stores I want to show you and give you a sneak peek. I will show you my Zara spring wish list and I will talk you through the process how I order online because Zara can be really really crazy. Their website is quite confusing in my opinion but I will show you what's in my shopping cart and I will tell you which are the uh, spring trends that I like that I will be wearing but first today we are going to H&M I also wanted to show you my new makeup favorites that I'm using and this primer I showed you earlier in this video I use L'Oreal Heterogeneous and then I use Nivea Q10 SPF 50 this combination works so well for me as a primer before makeup but this is what I do after I do my skincare routine for the morning and I highly recommend you to try this combo it gives you such a nice glow and actually I recommend it for dry skin if you have very oily skin it might be a little bit heavy like too glowy on your skin but my absolute new favorite product is also the CC cream from it cosmetics this one is the illumination one and I did my full spring makeup routine in my previous videos I will link it here so if you can watch that if you want to see my full makeup routine that I do but this is the product that I highly suggest you to try out 
it definitely has such a good coverage for CC cream. It's a huge surprise for me. It it's glowing and it sits very beautifully on the skin. It also has SPF of 50 and it has these anti-age and good skincare ingredients. So basically, it's a nice combo between a CC cream foundation type of makeup product and also and also the skincare benefits are amazing so huge huge thumbs up from me this is amazing product and I highly recommend you to check it out but without any further ado I will quickly grab my stuff and we're going to the mall First, we have this puffy sleeve top in blueprint. I really love this print. I think it's so pretty for the spring and summer season. And also the sleeves are really cute. I tried it on with the same jeans that I'm wearing today, but I also found these jeans and the quality of these looks amazing. But however, I really like these kind of tops for the season and especially of shorter i think they're very flattering yes this size is, looks a little bit loose on me you can see here but tucked into the jeans it's really cute I really like the color and the fit, but when they're wide leg, they have to be really wide the leg and long these, mm, these are not my fit. Next we have this nude creamy blazer, it's a very soft fibrous material and it's very nice and structured and and this super soft thin material will be perfect for the spring summer season. Oh yes, 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 big yes for me. How flattering is this dress? It's absolutely gorgeous. And it looks a little bit lighter on the camera, but it's tan caramelly color. Sorry, it's super loud. But I think this dress is just so beautiful and made super soft. I love the neckline, the rib details, and the buttons in the front. It's super figure hugging without being tight. The slit detail is so nice. I just think it's gorgeous and so flattering. It it's also very comfortable and I love this dress. This is in size S and I'm in love. This is exactly my kind of dress. Sure jackets, big trend for the season and I found this one with this really cute print on it, blue, grey and black, super wearable, it's very soft, it looks very nice with jeans and sweats, even with leggings, I think it's something different and a really nice option for outer wear for spring. Well, obviously, this is a dresses for me. I'm really drawn to the dresses for this season. I think I kind of miss them. And this one is so beautiful. The sleeves are very well made, the heart neckline, and the fit is very flattering.
Also, the material is this really nice, silky, soft material. It's really good quality. Very lightweight, flowy, and very beautiful. Yes, we have another beautiful dress in the hands to the print, but just look at the details of this dress, the seams here and here are super flattering, the thick straps and the shape are very like vintage but with a modern twist and it's so pretty, it's so beautiful. It has the a zipper on the side, so it's comfortable and easy to put on, as the pre previous dress had the zipper too. And I'm just in love with all of these dresses. Sorry if you're not into dresses, but uh, these were uh, the items that I liked the most. And if you're looking for a nice dress, definitely check out H&M. Something a little bit more put together. It's really beautiful blouse with this floral print, nice happy shoes, and high neck. I really like the high neck, but I would tuck this in, and I think it looks really nice to tuck into jeans. I love the cut of this top, the creamy color is so nice, I love the thick straps and it's also very nice soft knit. It's obviously for our summer but it looks so cute layered on their blazers or short jackets. And here it is top with this beautiful beige blazer. This one is better quality than the first that I showed you. I like this one better. It's a very nice structure. The belt color is so beautiful. The color is so nice and nice top jeans as a blazer is a good to look for me. I think this is such a simple but super pretty look. And I like that the blazer is a little bit loose and oversized and it has this boy boyish fit. Last but not least we have this sleeveless vest or sleeveless blazer. It's double breasted and I'm looking for something like this. I think it looks so nice. It's classy and, and it's again easy look but it looks so nice. Uh, this one is in size XS and it's made of linen material and it's nice but I prefer it if it wasn't linen. When you close it, it's pretty as well with a nice back and pair of heels. It will look amazing. And so I'm back, I just got back from the mall. It, it was really fun to go to the actual store, a little bit overwhelming and crowded, but I think I did a good job and I found some already nice pieces for the spring summer season. Let me know what was your favorite or what was your least favorite thing. Would you buy any of these items? For me, my favorites were definitely the rib midi dress in a beige camel color it was so beautiful and flattering so comfortable and at the same time it will look amazing just with a pair of sneakers a denim jacket or a leather jacket on top but you can also dress it up a little bit with a nice pair of block heels not very high and it will look very very lovely i also loved uh, the uh, cropped white creamy top with the blazer the second uh, beige blazer that i showed you it was uh, the better one definitely better quality and better fit and also the sleeveless vest even though as i told you i'm not, i didn't like that it's a linen but this style i really like and i think it looks very put together but effortlessly chic for the season but as i promised you i won't end the video here because i want to show you 
a sneak peek of my next Zara haul or what is my wish list for uh, the next season and what I'm gonna do is that I will show you what's in my shopping cart I will talk you through and tell you what trend is this, why I like it, what I don't like it and I will screen record my phone to show you some items so I don't know about you but I do use Zara's app and I recommend it but here are the items that are at the moment in my shopping cart and when I place Zara orders I really think about it and plan my looks and my outfits because first of all this is what I do and I film them for you for YouTube and I want my wardrobe to be very curated and I want to be cohesive and all the items to represent my personal style that's why I usually very carefully plan my orders but this is what we have here at the moment and some trendy pieces that I like so first we have this blazer textured check blazer um, I really like the light blue a light blue is a very big trend blue and blue blue and like denim all light blue looks it's very trendy you can see that it's a very nice classic fit and this material is a very designer kind of inspired it has this vibe which i like and what i don't like is only that the buttons are silver i would prefer the golden ones and also make sure to always check the suggested pages down below you can find cute items as well and for me i always get my blazers in size s so this is the first item that i have asymmetric knit top i'm a huge huge fan of tops uh, with asymmetric shapes because they're very different and interesting they really draw attention and the eye to the top and to the whole look this knit looks very fine and delicate i like the mesh together with the knit and the color also really matches my style I also absolutely love how it's styled with the skirt with the print This top I think I will delete from my basket It's another asymmetric top, one shoulder It's really cute, it will look very nice with jeans and high waisted pants But I think it's not super interesting I will have to think about this one But, but I think it's a little bit similar to items that I have at the moment Next we have white leg trousers, another big trend, another color that I like. I'm not sure if these will fit me uh, and if they will be flattering on me, but it's always worth trying. Also, I have a very similar scarf to the way they are on the model and I like this look. Scarves and scarf tops are another fashionable thing and i think it will be super easy for me to recreate this look and also with shirt and crop tops these pants will probably look very nice we'll see this item is i'm a huge fan of first because i really love green my wardrobe is pretty neutral but green i absolutely love especially for spring summer this looks so nice when I have a little bit of tan and I don't know if you can see but this skirt has very interesting shape a little bit asymmetric seams in the front and I'm sure it will be very flattering paired with white top, white shirt or some of the tops that I will order I think it will look amazing this top is very interesting I love the crisscross details it will look nice with jeans with my beige high-waisted trousers from Zara and also even with the skirt that I just showed you I saw this one on Instagram and it looked amazing so that's exactly what I'm talking that I find a lot of inspo on Instagram and I think it looks very chic it's very pretty and the crisscross detail definitely adds a lot of character and this sophisticated vibe to the entire outfit also this is a pop of color perfect mini spring dress uh, I'm not sure if I will have a lot of occasions to wear it but why not things are opening up slowly I'm sure I will wear this a lot, the price is very reasonable it also comes in two different colors in orange and in purple as well the light purple is also pretty but I definitely prefer the 
pink and i want to style this dress with this white satin shirt i think it will look very feminine very chic i have to see this shirt in person but it looks very silky and soft and i think it will look so nice paired with the, this dress also with the green skirt i think it will be a great outfit and a white shirt like this is a wardrobe staple I think something you can go wrong with and you can see paired with jeans even on this model it looks so nice another pair of trousers these look very nicely high-waisted color that I love and with this thick waistband I think they will be very flattering with small fitted bodysuits or even with a shirt of course i have to try them on because they look a little bit baggy on the model but usually when i try them on they look better and the last item that i have in my card is this knit corset top in creamy white color corset tops another huge trend at the moment i think they are very beautiful and feminine i think they can really elevate a basic pair of jeans or trousers another Flattering item, it will look nice with high-waisted trousers and with the trousers that I showed you for this purchase that I'm making. I'm not 100% sure about it, but I think it looks cute and it's probably worth trying. Even though I already know I will like it, I think it's a good basic to have, super versatile, and I will be uh, able to wear it in many different outfits. So this is it for my spring Zara wishlist. These are some of the items that you will see in my next strand haul. So if you like these videos, please don't forget to subscribe down below. My camera is dying, so I will end this video here. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Let me know which were the items that you like the most that I showed you in this video. And hopefully I will see you in my next one. Ciao! Thank you.